Detecting top of the day number two, eight fifteen, April tenth, two thousand twenty-four. We'll talk about this day is two bug. Okay, I'm going to send this video to the owner of XP for additional information to help his team maybe solve this problem faster. Okay, now I've done looked at this versions two zero zero one point one and one zero zero. And what you're going to see in this WS6 here, version 100. Let me turn this camera off briefly. Okay, so all three versions, 1.0, 1.1, and 2.0, that's the only three modes I've checked. All three using that WS6, they all mirror one another. The Gold Field and the Relic Programs. Okay, I use that nail there and a U.S. nickel. This may help XP. Okay, this machine, when it's turned on, I did a video earlier. If this machine doesn't come on in either Goldfield or Relic program and you intend to use those two programs, you need to put it in one of those two programs, turn the machine off. Turn the machine back on. Set your Relic or Goldfield program up and use it and you will get correct ops. If you transition, you can transition between Goldfield and Relic, but you cannot go to any other programs on that machine using those two programs and come back to them with the current settings. The machine will not perform correctly. You have to turn the machine off in either Goldfield or Relic mode and set them up to get them to work right. I've done looked at this. Even transitioning to the mono program from Goldfield and going back messes it up. Messes up the Relic program. If you turn the machine on and it's in the general program and you transition over to Goldfield or Relic program, Dial in max, max IR, speed 2.5, max frequency of 40, it'll give signal on that nickel instead of iron tone. You can try this with your machine and you will see it, what I'm telling you. So the end users, that's who I'm worried about here. The end users, just be advised. If you intend to use either of those two programs, you can transition between them. I've done looked at that. You can go from Goldfield to Relic and Relic to Goldfield and you won't have a problem. As long as the machine was turned on in one of those two programs, if you intend to use one of those two programs, you transition out of either one of those programs into anything else besides those two and you come back, you could be in for a ride using that machine and be misled. This applies to the remote and the WS6. Okay. That's going to conclude the video. I hope everybody has a nice day.